Now as they grow up, we take turns, where would you like to go for dinner, where would you like to go, and so on, and the kids decide. And now, when they're adults, they feel that their opinion is valid. When they meet with other adults, they feel that their opinion is valid because they've been trained all their lives that their opinion is worth something. So number one is a democratic environment. Number two is a climate of positive expectations. Is the parents expect their kids to do well. Just like I tell my kids, you're going to be a very successful person when you grow up. You're going to do extremely well. You're going to be very popular. You're going to get good grades. When you expect the best of your children, children rise to your expectations. They may argue with you. They may reject. They may, they may discount your, your positive statements because you're a parent, but it affects them at an unconscious level. I remember reading a wonderful line from a journalist. He said, my father was not very talkative, he said. He was a good man, but he didn't talk very much. But I do remember him saying one thing which affected my whole life. He said, son, I expect you to do something worthwhile with your life when you grow up. He said, I still remember that because whenever it came up, he'd say, son, whatever you do, I expect you to do something worthwhile with your life when you grow up. He said, that rang in my mind all my life. He said, I've striven all my life to do something worthwhile with my life, just because of the positive expectations. So it's really important. Telling people that you expect the best of them. If you're married, telling your spouse that you believe in them and that you expect the best and you believe they'll be successful. And if they're not successful, then they'll learn something. They'll be successful next time. Just repeating that over and over again is the greatest blessing that a person can have. Okay, so expect the best. Expect the best of other people. Expect the best of yourself, too.